Kawada-san talks about a productivity miracle and I think you're suggesting maybe there's a better name. What would you call it if you were teaching what Dr. Kawada-san is teaching? Only miracle. Only miracle. Nothing else. It's a miracle for business. Am I correct? Uh, business, uh, productivity, quality, and uh, research and innovation. Especially we have uh, more than 10 chemical innovations in our body. And again, is this because Kawada-san taught you how to find the innovations or how to speak together clearly? Uh, how to find the talent, how to explore the talent, and how to communicate with, with each other in specific point of view. Okay, excellent. I'm going to ask now for, for you to give me an idea of how long it took from the time you engaged Kawada-san to the time you started eating up the other sharks in the ocean. <laughs> how long did that take? From the first months, we get fantastic results. From the first months, it is nearly 10 years we are um, continuing this, uh, I believe, uh, knowledge or miracle, but it came up from the first day we start. In after one month, uh, we find out lots of uh, topics we should concentrate on. After one year, uh, we became uh, Iran. Uh, we became one of one hundred good companies. Wow. But in previous two years, Abad Garan became Iran's best chemical manufacturer chosen, chosen from Ministry of Industry and uh, Standard Organization. And gave, they gave us a gold award. Wow. Okay. I'm, I'm engaged. W tell me what happened after a month. What was the one thing that somebody could physically see or engage in your company and say, that's... Excellent. What was that? Uh, in the first months, um, when we sit together, we realize that we are all speak Farsi, but we are not understanding each other correctly. Uh, whatever is, for example, as a QC department, whatever is my concern is not a sales department concern. So after that, we went, we took the steps to how to communicate each other better and how we can understand our concerns much better. Okay. That was the first step, speaking together, understanding our concerns. So no, normally, even if you said we understood that we weren't speaking the same language, that is enough in one month. So tell me about the steps after that. What were the next steps after you realized we're not talking the same language? Okay. Mostly when, as a, for example, top management, when you go to financial department, they give you a report. For example, what happened in past months? What, what was your profit in past week? What was your profit in past year? How much we have stock for now? When you go, normally when you go to financial department, they give you history. But as a top management of the company, I should know where I'm going, where I, I'm driving. Think I'm a driver. I need very crystal clear glass in front of me. But financial department is a small mirror somewhere here, and they are only showing me behind. What is this? So Professor Kavada teach us how we can make this glass, front glass, crystal clear, and how we can put more sensors 
like auto drive we face in Tesla system. I love the analogy that looking in your rear view mirror is less important today as looking in the front view windshield. I love that analogy. Uh, but what physically did he do to force some of those indicators for, mm -hmm. for you to understand where you're going? What, what changed? Okay. First, uh, I choose some uh, uh, very thirsty, I mean thirsty knowledge. Uh, very thirsty people in my company in different divisions, from R&D, QC, production, sales department, financial department, IT team, we sit together. First of all, in past, as a chairman of the company, I decided what I want my company to be in next 10 years. But from methodology of Professor Kavada, he told me, you should change yourself. You should let your employee to be part of designing team for your future. When they sit together, when they think together, when they are part of designing team of the company, then you will see what will happen when you are going to process. So I changed my steps because normally uh, I decided uh, very fast, maybe in 24 hours, maximum 48 hours, my decision is being made through uh, consulting with my consultant uh, department. So in the beginning, I wait nearly at least 20 days. I ask them to analyze the market. I let them to understand what will happen to our business in future. And after 20 days, they came to me with lots of fantastic ideas. What opportunities we have, what potentials we have, and how we can make it happen very fast. So in the beginning, I let them to come um, to a, I believe, a brainstorming room. They brought lots of ideas. Then we started to put check marks. We started to choose the best ideas. Finally, after one month, we understood where we want to go in next 10 years. So wow. we choose the target after one month. Normally, I uh, choose this at, in 48 hours. It was not as great as it is right now. But after one month, only waiting for the team and let them understand better I had fantastic targets for my company.